why do you want to be a priest and what was the impetus for taking those first steps? Well, I think the, the reason why I want to become a priest is because I've always had a, a sense of wanting to serve, uh, serve the people. And I always looked for a way to figure out how to, how to serve. And uh, through the example of my pastor, Father Jim Shirtliff, uh, how he served the people uh, and how it brought him great joy was something that is, is, is something that really resonated with me. And it's really something I wanted to see if the priesthood was for me so that I could bring that joy and love of Christ to everybody. So what excites you about the priesthood or about any specific ministries or what, what are you excited about doing in the future? Well, I think one thing that really excites me about the priesthood is the, uh, well, the, the big reason is the fact that the, the priest gets to take ordinary bread and wine and consecrate that into the precious body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. Uh, you know, we're just humble servants and we get such a great honor to be able to, you know, do such an extraordinary thing. And it's not only, it's not for us, but it's for everyone. So. What do you find most encouraging or enjoyable about seminary life? Oh, the, the fraternity. Uh, you know, um, I love being with the other guys. And we're all striving for the same goal. We're all striving uh, for hopefully one day for ordination to become priest. And then, you know, continue that friendship on in our priesthood and just the, the strong fraternity we have for one another and the the care and the, and the love we have for one another is, is just so rewarding and it makes seminary life totally worth it. What has surprised you about seminary or about the discernment process? Uh, the things that surprised me I guess would be the how much you grow. Uh, you, you grow in your personality you grow in friendships, and you, you grow in your faith, and you grow in, in your prayer life, and your, your love for the Eucharist. You know, going into seminary, you, you don't, sometimes you don't have the strongest prayer life, but through your time there and, th and through your, just your, your years of formation, you, you grow more into a, a prayerful life, and, and you grow a stronger love f for your faith and for the Eucharist. So what haven't I asked you about that you want to share with the world? About discernment, about vocations in general, about the seminary? What do you think is something that everybody should know about what you guys do? Well, I, I, I think one thing everybody should know is that we, you know, we're, we're, we're normal guys. We're normal guys who are, who are trying to uh, see if the vocation to the priesthood is for us. We're trying to see if, you know, if, if this is what God really wants us to do with, do with our lives. You know, not everybody is called to that and that's what the seminary is for we come to find it so i think one thing is if, if you really think you have a call to the priesthood uh you, you should go and try it you know at least give it a little go because uh if if anything you'll just grow more in your faith and you'll have friendships that last forever and so i think i think it's it's very important and it uh it's really changed my life and had a great impact on me